This video will demonstrate how to programmatically launch a workflow in an IBM Maxmo application. I want to dynamically route a workflow in the work order tracking application whenever a work order is approved. To do this, I will use TRM's Rules Manager Studio. Opening the application developer perspective, I will open the editor for the work order tracking app by double clicking the WoTrack item in the App Explorer on the left. I will then right click the change status icon and select the on status change option to create a rule that will fire when a user changes the status of a work order in this application. In the on status change editor I will filter this rule to only fire when the status is changed to approved. I will then add a simple script which will execute any time a user approves a work order. The script editor page of my event will provide me with Content Assist. Content Assist guides me as I write my script. It will tell me what variables and methods I can access in the context of this status change. Furthermore, it will validate my script to ensure I did not make any typos. Using the app object, I can perform common application functionality, such as stopping a workflow process or routing a workflow process. I will commit my new rule and verify it works correctly. To quickly navigate to the work order tracking application in a browser, I right click the WoTrack item in the App Explorer and select the Open with Internet Browser option. Approving a waiting work order will then fire my new rule. See our other tutorials on how to quickly create a regression test for this configuration or restrict it to specific users, records, or other contexts.